hey what's up guys i hope you are doing well in today's video we are going to talk about adding a surface okay so i'm going to uh, enable the shortcuts and let me delete this one and <coughs> shift a i'll just go to surface nerve curve and i'll just move this one by pressing g and putting it like this and surface sur uh, nerp circle i'll press g and put it like this shift a and nerp surface and pressing it like this and shift a nerp cylinder and shift a nerp sphere i can put it here and surface uh, nerp torus you see maybe you said what's the difference we saw the sphere here too in the in this one and circle in this one and torus in this one and cylinder in this one no they are different if i put a, a cylinder you see it's not same and another thing is that if you press tab you see it's like this but in this one in this one it's not like this it's uh if you press tab you can see it's like a cage if i select this one and press g you see i can move it like this but in the other the other one the mesh one we have many vertices okay not like this one this is like a rhino uh, rhino program using rhino okay if you used rhino for architecture you can you can see it's like this Another thing is that we can change this one and press G and select this one and shift selecting multiple one and pressing G or pressing Z so it will be like this and tab so it will be like this. Another thing that is that we can change this one to this one this one and pressing G like this and uh, tab you see it's like this and let's see this one yeah let's see this one and press G you see it's a lot there's a little change but but let's press and you see it's like this another thing is that we can select this one and press tab you can see it's like this if you want to change it you can change it like this but if you want to extend it you should press E for extrude you see extrude E extrude E extrude like this and press tab it will be something like this you see and we can add a modifier over this we can go to the modifier uh, properties and go give a uh, a solidify what's solidify it's giving it a thickness okay so for example giving it a thickness like this we can use this one but later on we will talk about it later okay so this one let's press tab you can see we can change it like this and change it like this you see but if i want to create a face for this one if i press f you see too few selection to merge so it gives an error so what should we do to make it a face we should press tab and go to here object so convert to mesh okay convert it to a mesh and press tab and press f you see nothing changed because you should select all press a it will select all and press f it will create a face so press tab and you see a face is created so this was adding a mesh and i hope it was helpful and see you in the next video goodbye